situation and you've been homeless before but I can tell you I've been there and I was there as an adult so I know what it's like not having a place to call your home and I guarantee you there's some people sitting right here on this grass that have been there and you may be there right now but here's the deal here's the thing I want us to get we have to get to a point where we start to become helpers of one to the other so everybody that asks you for money on the street is not a it's not a drug addict some people are asking for money because they really need it some people aren't even asking for your money. They're just asking for your help. And I'm gonna tell you something, when you have no place to go, a smile goes a long way, a real long way. It, it brightens up your day, even though I ain't got a place to lay my head. Just the fact that you didn't look down on me and you smiled at me makes me feel so much better. So here's what I want us to do a little bit. I know 
we in the Bronx and we're not used to saying hello and hi to everybody. You know, but I want everybody to get up who can, if you're able to, if the legs are working and the body's working. I want you to find somebody that you don't know. Now, you can greet them however you so desire. So if you feel like greeting them with a nice handshake, that's cool. Nice smile is cool. Or if you want to go all out and give them a hug, it's cool. But the thing I want you to understand is that we need each other. So in Wham Bam, come on down. So on the count of three, so we can make it all one. Oh, God, I got a hug already. On the count of three, I want you to find somebody and say, we need you. One, two, come on, bring that beat back. We need you. We need you. 